Hey everybody, it's Miss Snicker. Um, I just found an easier and faster way for you to connect to your child's Artsonia portfolio if you haven't already discovered this yourself. Um, you can get the code from me. Um, it's just, I guess, more work on both of our ends. But if you, once you, your child opens up Artsonia um, for the first time or whenever they're logging in and they're clicking on students, um, so the first time they have to do the code and that code again is B T J R N T B P. And then they pick their grade and their team. And then they find their name. Then you will see um, when you get to this page, right um, underneath announcements, to connect a parent. So you can then go ahead and hit that button and then put your email address in there. And then once you um, do that, you will get an email um, that tells you to approve it and then it'll ask you to set up your own account with your email and a, uh, a password. And so then you can um, log into Artsonia and you can do all these, um, all these nice things with, um, with that as well. So I'll take a, show you what that looks like. I just skipped over the part where you open up the email and approve everything and set up your own account with your own email and password. And then here you can choose your relationship and then put in your number if you want to add that so you can get information via text. Um, so here's um, some of the, a list of the other things that you can do once you're connected to your child's account. So you can start a fan club so you can connect family members and friends that um, you want to see their artwork. They'll get an instant email when the kid uploads something. You can approve um, any comments that friends and family leave. You can read any of the feedback that I would provide. I won't always do this just because the amount of students that I have, but when I do provide feedback, you can see that. Um, you will have access to the, the gift shop where you can buy merchandise with all of your child's artwork on it. And then if they have any extra projects that they want to upload from artwork that they're doing at home, you can do that. So there's a place where you can um, upload their artwork under your account so that that can be added to their portfolio, especially if it's a project that you would like to buy merchandise for. That's what that would look like. So once you click continue, then you'll get this little message board and you'll see the artwork. And if I click on their portfolio, um, I will kind of get a little preview of the gift shop. And you can see here one of the important reasons why um, we want to take good photographs. So this picture has a big shadow on it and if you're going to be buying merchandise with that artwork you want to make sure you have a good photograph otherwise the merchandise is going to show all of the shadows and anything else you don't crop. So here are all of the um, items that are available in the gift shop right now. So this is kind of just a fun way to personalize gifts if you're giving something to somebody. Uh, it's, it's kind of fun. And like we said earlier, the 20% um, of the proceeds come back to the art department, so it just benefits the kids even more where we have um, access to, um, to more materials. So thanks for taking the time to watch, and let me know if you have any questions.